The input controls available vary depending on both the type of input source and the channel width. The left-hand side contains controls that relate specifically to the input port. On the right are the controls that relate to the channel. The port selection shows the port labels and the type of port that is connected. Here we see a mic line source connected to the channel, so mic gain and phantom power controls are available. Access a channel with an AES source connected and the port controls change. Sample rate converter switches are now available. The channel input section contains controls appropriate to the width of the currently accessed channel. Access a mono channel and we see just two controls, input trim and polarity invert. Accessing a stereo channel displays additional controls, separate polarity invert switches for left and right, an MS decoder switch, input balance to adjust the incoming signal level between left and right, and left to both and right to both switches. The control window header contains general input controls. The tone button toggles tone to the channel on and off. The input 1 and input 2 buttons toggle between two input sources. This is commonly used to connect a second mic as a backup. Each of the two inputs have their own set of input controls, but all other channel functions, including EQ, dynamics and channel sends, remain unchanged regardless of which of the two inputs is in use.